Hi, this is Julia Waldorf, juliawaldorf.com, and I have Stephen here, who is a homeless man that, um, as I was driving out of the Trader Joe's over here in Slow County, um, was sitting there with the sign saying, please help. And uh, Stephen, what's, what's your story? Yeah. On this rainy day, I know you're cold, <laughs> you're wet, and it's miserable to be homeless, I know that. Well, you just make it what, what you make it to be. If you're going to be miserable, you're going to have misery. But, right. You know, if you're homeless and you have no choice, you do what you got to do and uh, make the effort every day to... To survive. Right. And So why are you homeless? Do you mind me asking? Well, it's a long story. You make a long story short? <laughs> make a long story short. I have a wife still in L.A. Uh-huh. And I... Uh, I came here and uh, I came to Slow County and uh, I just liked it here. And I, uh -huh. I have a couple of buddies I camp with. Uh huh. And okay. We, uh, we help each other out and uh, we get by every day. Okay. Yeah. And you, you have a community going on with your friends. Yeah. Yeah. So how long have you been homeless? Uh, probably about uh, let's see. I'm going to be 49 on the 25th of March. I've been homeless about uh, 10 years. Ten years? Yeah. So what's um consecutively. Okay, so how I mean what was the very when you the very if you remember ten years ago, why did you lose a job or Yeah, I lost a job. Uh-huh. Lost my girlfriend, she lost her house, I had to move her out. Uh-huh. And then everything there was nothing. There was no house, she had to move in with a friend. Uh-huh. I couldn't stay there so I had nowhere else to go. So I went to the streets. So it's been hard to get back on your feet. Yeah, it's really hard because uh, I lost my, well actually I, yeah. not to even get into the hardships, but right. you know, people steal from one another on the streets and it's not really a nice thing, but uh -huh. I don't do it, neither do any of my buddies, but uh, some people do and uh -huh. someone stole my wallet, so it's it's hard to try, I need a social security card so I can go into EDD and I can get on a computer, I got post a resume and I'll get a job and I can work from the streets, it's not a problem. Oh, I see, so your, your identity stolen, card. so it's hard. Oh, right. <laughs> it's as simple as getting the freaking card and the number. Oh, jeez. And you don't get a phone number, so it's... Yeah, that's hard. People can't get a hold of you. You don't have a mailing address and people can't write you. Right. So it's, all, it's hard. It's yeah. just hard. Yeah. I can't imagine. I just can't imagine. You seem like a very nice man. <laughs> and I'm sorry you're going through the... You're the lifestyle of the homelessness, you know? Ten years is a long time and it's just hard it's hard to get back on your feet with once you start tumbling. It's hard because, well, I traveled. I, I came from L.A. Uh -huh. I walked from L.A. to Santa Barbara. Wow, it's a long walk. Yeah, and then I walked from Santa Barbara to Lompoc and some people blessed me with a bicycle and then I rode here and I've been here ever since. Wow, all right. Well, at least you got friends here. Yeah. And all is good and you seem happy. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Well, thank you, Stephen, for the interview. You're welcome. Have a beautiful day. Likewise. Julia Waldorf, juliawaldorf.com. Ciao, ciao.